Hi guys and welcome back to the How Much Tech channel. If you're wondering why your laptop or a smartphone will happily charge from some USB plugs but not others, the answer is found in this video. Fear not, we've rounded up some great examples of the best 5 USB-C power delivery chargers that will actually work and that you can buy right now. While there are undoubtedly cheaper chargers out there, picking a trusted or premium brand may reduce the safety risks associated with overheating. Some of our favorites include Anchor, Sateki, Synquire, and Ugreen. The links to all the products mentioned in this video are available in the description below. So without any more delay, let's get started with the video. Number 5. Ugreen 65W USB-C Charger. With 65W potential, this ultra-compact USB-C wall charger can power most mid-sized laptops, although larger notebooks may require a more powerful 100-watt charger. It has two USB-C PD ports, and when using both it can power at 45W and 20W so could fast charge your phone while keeping a laptop ticking. It supports power delivery 3.0 PPS and quick charge 3.0 so is speed ready for most devices. Owners of phones with an old-style USB at charging cable may need to buy a new cable with USB-C at one end. It's also competitively priced for a 65-watt charger, supports international voltages, and, because it uses Gantech, it's a ditty little thing for such a powerful device, especially the UK version. Unless you need additional USB ports or 100-watt, we really can't see how you'd be better served by another power delivery charger. Number 4. Ugreen Nexode 100W USB-C Charger This Ugreen device is a powerful 100W laptop charger. The UK 3-pin model has a different design to those available in the US and Europe, necessarily so because the elongated design and sheer weight of this thing would likely have trouble staying attached to the wall without that third prong to steady itself. The 235 grams US model has a taller, more rectangular design with folding plugs to make them more compact for travel, but the core specs are otherwise the same. We like the design, and it feels much better made than some cheap plasticky chargers. There are no angular edges here, with every line smoothed out and rounded to soften its appearance. The outer casing is a matte gunmetal gray, and all the necessary tech specs are hidden out of sight where the adapter plugs into the wall. It's not overly bulky, despite its weight, thanks to the GAN tech inside. But it's really not about what it looks like, it's about what it does. And this Ugreen GAN X100 watt adapter has some serious power behind it. There are four USB ports in all, three USB-C and one full-size USB-A, two of which support a 100 watt output, with the other two rated at 22.5 watt. There's a maximum power output of 100 watt, which means when you use more than one port, the power rating will be reduced, but it's still possible to get up to 65 watt on either of those two 100 watt USB Cs. Number 3 Anchor Nano 65 Watt GAN PPS Fast Charger. Anchor is perhaps one of the best known names in charging tech, and this single port PD charger is attractive to us for several reasons. Gallium nitride technology has made chargers a fraction of the size of silicon-based models only a couple of years old and once considered small themselves. Anchor's new nano chargers utilize next-generation GAN tech that transmits energy more efficiently and operates at twice the frequency of the first generation of GAN, making these chargers even smaller. We haven't seen PD chargers this small before. They are tiny about the size of Apple's Weedy 5-watt iPhone charger, but over 10x more powerful. The 65-watt Nano Charger weighs just 132 grams, the US version features neat foldable pins. Moreover, they support not only power delivery, quick charge, and Anchor's own PowerIQ smart charging, but also PBS. This means it stands out among other third-party adapters in its ability to fast-charge smartphones such as the Samsung Galaxy S22 that require the super-fast charging protocol for their proprietary charging standards. On the downside, there is only one output, which means you can charge only one device at a time, and it'll need to support USB-C. Number 2. 
Syncwire PD 30 Watt USB C Charger. This 30 watt power delivery charger from Syncwire keeps things simple with a single USB C output for charging your phone, tablet, or potentially laptop. There's support here for PPS, but it's worth pointing out that 30 watt is not enough to charge all laptops, so do check your spec to see if it's appropriate before you buy. It should be plenty for a MacBook Air, but not some of the larger, more powerful laptops. If it's powerful enough for your needs, this is a really appealing device, significantly more affordable than other devices in our roundup. And thanks to Gantech, it has a sleek, compact design that is easily portable. We like the smooth, rounded corners and the tiny LED that sits just above and lights up the USB port when in use. Number 1. Satechi 75 Watt Dual USB-C PD This Satechi's desktop charger has two USB-C power delivery ports and two USB-A ports, especially useful if you're traveling with more than one power-hungry USB-C device or a mix of USB-C and USB-A. However, do note that one of the USB-C ports will charge at the full 90 watt and the other at a more sedate 18 watt. The two USB-A ports are handy as most of us still have devices that require a charging cable connected to this old standard. Each can handle 12 watt charging, but that capacity is shared between the two ports, so will be lower if both are in use. This is fine if you are charging one phone or two lower-powered devices, such as headphones or a watch. At 417 grams, it isn't super lightweight, but is a desktop charger, so will probably not be traveling with you. A more mighty model, the Sateki 165-watt USB-C 4-port PD GAN charger is a real power beast. For $119, it has two 100-watt capable USB-C ports and two that can reach 60-watt, although the max output is 165-watt. It's the highest of any of the chargers we have tested here. You can charge a large laptop and a mid-sized laptop at the same time. I hope you like this video. I have tried my best to provide accurate information about the products which are available in the market so that you can pick the correct product for your purpose. If you have any questions or suggestions, please comment down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.